Nanach Nachman Nachman. We're learning the Kutimaran, a gathering of our master, Nanach Nachman Nachman Miman. The second volume, Torah 7, the seventh Torah, this, and Os Zayn, the seventh part. And this wise holy person that merits to be makifim, the surrounding peripheral intelligence, now Bechina Shefa Keser, which is an aspect of the abundance of the Keser, the highest sphere, which is surrounding everything. He needs to have the aspect of Kol, everything. Like it says in the verse that everything is in the high, in the sky and the earth. Vitagumo and the translation of the Jonas and Benazil, the great sage, is the Achid Vishmayavara, which is one, or is actually grasping in the sky and in the Earth. That he has to have this aspect of kol, which is translated as grasping and supporting the both the world, the sky and the earth. The higher world and the lower world. Which are an aspect of the sky and the earth. Because the tzaddik, the righteous, wise person he has to be grasping both of them the kaim is kol echad ve'echad bebchinasol to support and uphold each one according to its aspect ki yesh toi malav yesh toi matav because there are those that dwell above they are pertain to the above and there are those that dwell in the bottom the hainu olam ve'elyum volam atachim of the world, the upper world, and the bottom world. Bechina Shemaim Vars, the aspect of sky and earth. And the Tzadik, the righteous person, has to show those that live above that in truth they do not know anything about the knowledge of the Blessed One. That is, the comprehension of ma of nothingness of what an aspect of what the Zohar says what did you see what did you touch an aspect of where is the place of his glory in other words those people that are, are on the higher level that apparently they have some understanding of the greatness of God so the true tzaddik has to give them a taste of ma, of the level of of real reality, of not knowing anything, the highest epitome of knowledge. Ulahapich and in the reverse, Tsarh Lahaus Ludari Mata, he has to show those that are living in the bottom. Sha'adraba, that on the contrary, Mulokhalat Kodo those that are dwelling on the bottom, that is, that they don't really comprehend and perceive God, the tzaddik has to show them that in reality, God's glory fills the whole world. Because there are those that dwell in the earth. That is, people that are on the lower, on bottom levels. And it appears to them that they are very, very distant from the Holy Blessed One. And the righteous one, the tzaddik, has to arouse them and wake them up. An aspect of what it says in the verse in Isaiah. Wake up and rejoice, sing. Those that dwell in the earth he has to wake up. The tzaddik has to do this. The people that are dwelling in the earth, that are in the lower levels, he has to wake them up. And to reveal to them that the Holy Holy One is with them. 
they're very close to the Blessed One. Because the whole world is filled with His glory. And to strengthen them and to arouse them that they should not have despair on themselves. Heaven forbid. Because they are still next to the Holy Blessed Name and very close to Him. Because the whole world is filled with His glory. And this is the aspect of call everything that the righteous one, the tzaddik, has to have bechinas, an aspect that everything is grasping the sky and the earth. The achid That is, he grasps and he upholds both worlds. He grasps and he supports the upper world with the aspect of ma what nothing. The aspect of where is the place of glory? So he shows those in the upper world that apparently have some type of conception and perception of God. He shows them nothing. What do they know? What do we know where God's glory is? And the lower world, he, the tzaddik, the righteous one, supports by showing them those that apparently they can't perceive God at all. He shows them that in reality God's glory fills the whole world. But I am the command and later Sham of War Gamkanians there in the later Torah is also explained this matter but very success with a little more explanation. But Klaw the general rule is Shatzadik that the righteous one, Sadik Ikushle Muso, his main perfection and completion is when he has both these aspects. That is that he knows how to speak and teach and to light up, illuminate for everyone, each person. Those that dwell above and those that dwell below. The upper ones and the down ones. But Shemayim of Arts and the sky and the earth, Shem Bechinas Gedolim Muktanim, which are the aspects of the great ones, the big ones, and the small ones. Hanu Shagdolim B'Maila, that is those of the higher stature, B'nei Aliyah, those that are that are people that keep rising. Bechinas Dari Maila, those that dwell above. Sorch Shia Koach LaTadik, the Tadik has to have the power, the ability, to show them and to reveal to them that they still do not know nothing of the Holy Blessed Name. An aspect of what do you see, what do you feel? Nothing. And this, these lessons and comprehension, the Tadik has to illuminate and shine and bring into those great people, the greater people, the great ones of stature, Shem Bechinas Dari that are the aspect of those that dwell above. and on the contrary, Yesh Bnei Adam, there are people Shumunachim B'Madriga that are that are lying in the lowest levels. Atcha Yumiyashim Satzman Gami, they completely give up and despair. Chas Shalom, heaven forbid. Because it appears to him that they are very distant from the Holy Blessed Name. And they have already lost all the chance and hope from the Holy One. So the Tzadik, the righteous one, has to have the ability to arouse them and wake them up. That they should not despair and give up on themselves in 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 any way, any way in the world. be what it may. and to show them and illuminate for them, to light shine the light for them. That the Holy One is still with them, the etzlam, the them, and next to them, and close to them. And even in the earth itself, 
even if he fell to the depths of hell, chas v'sholom, heaven forbid, afal pikein, even still, sham daika nimsa kvodo yisbach, there, specifically there, the glory of God, the Blessed One, could be found. Because the whole world is filled with His glory. And this ability to do both, to teach those high and above, is the aspect of kol, everything, which the tzaddik, the righteous person has, come out.